Who woulda thunk it? This 0.9.0 world making it all the way to 1.1. Guys, it is here. <laughs> you know what? Believe it or not, 10 minutes after last episode, this update came out. I was like, oh my god. Yeah, but um... Oh well, I, that's good though, because we were able to get a whole episode out of us preparing. So now we don't have to do any preparing. We are ready to roll, aren't we, Buster? Are you ready? To well, actually, we're going to mess around with some update stuff before we go on our adventure. Look, new sleeping animation. That's weird, isn't it? <laughs> that's interesting, I guess. I always do that before I go to sleep, don't you guys? Um, yeah, you know what else is weird? This. What the? But the... The earth changed axis? <laughs> my son used to rise behind this house and set behind the survival lab. Now it rises behind my greenhouses and sets behind that mountain over there. Minecraft, are you drunk? <laughs> like, I don't know what that is. You know what the first thing I realized in this update was? Is this. Now, give me it. Give me it. Come here, Eeyore. It won't hurt. Look. Freaking... Uh, the leads have physics like look at that. I just grabbed him earlier, and I'm like whoa look at that It looks all real. <laughs> that's kind of That's actually really cool. I, I never thought of something like that in Minecraft. It's like almost too realistic for Minecraft But I like it. <laughs> oh man. Yep So as you guys know we are getting ready to go on a huge adventure today looking for a woodland mansion And our first priority is obviously to get a cartographer And I did not disappoint I breeded and I got one where are ya? Oh, yeah, he's in here. Look! A white bed! <laughs> uh, I, it didn't change my other beds. I guess I have to break them and then... I don't know, it's kind of weird. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna make my favorite colored beds. Alright, so... Uh... Emerald... No, wait. I think I need paper for cartographers first, right? Is he still... <gasps> he is, thank God. What was this one? Yeah, so I breeded a... Oh, no! Get back! <laughs> I breeded a... Oh, my God, a cart... Oh, this is so awesome. Uh, I can't even talk. <laughs> so yeah, um, I just went into these stalls and started throwing a bunch of wheat everywhere. <laughs> and they started breeding. And then I waited about 20 minutes and he finally grew up. So we need to go get... Oh, wait. Eeyore has my paper. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, do not go up there, dude. <laughs> that would be so bad if he did that. Anyway, okay. I guess we're going to go ahead and see what... We can get. Oh gosh, I'm excited. I've never touched a map from a cartographer. I've waited till this day. Well, until we either start our PC Minecraft series or this one. Okay, you didn't try any. Okay, thanks, dude. <laughs> you were supposed to unlock something for me. Do it for the people. We want to see those precious. Oh. Oh, okay, a compass. Okay, I can do that. So let me go get a compass. Just. What? What? Why are my doors open? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Bear back. I got the compass. Is this what you wanted? Here. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and trade that. He's probably going to make me trade it again. Come on, dude. We want to see those precious... Ma <gasps> oh, what the... I don't want that. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and try to... Oh, man, I'm running out of paper. I need some paper for our adventure. Come on, please. Please, for the slime. This world has been here forever. We've been waiting for you for... Si of course you didn't. All right, I'm going to risk it. I'm going to buy an empty map. You better unlock it. Right now, sir. We need... Yes! <gasps> Ocean's Explorer map and... W oh, God, guys. Are you ready for this? Let me go get another compass. Dude, you're greedy. Okay, dude. I got your compass. I don't know why I have to be so greedy with all this stuff. All right. Here we go. Oh, I'm so excited, dude. Oh, I forgot that there were Ocean Explorer maps, too. That means we can go finally find one. Oh, that's so exciting news. Oh, wait. Oh, hang on. <laughs> Gotta create the compass for... Oh, wait. Hey there. Iron Golem's gonna go die. Alright, so... I need some of that. Oh, I don't even have a crafting table. Oh, hang on. Okay, dude, here I am. Cartographer. Yes! <laughs> I'm building this up too much. Finally, we can do this. I've never held one of these maps in my life. Not even in creative mode. I've waited to record it in an actual Let's Play. <sighs> nah, I don't feel... Oh, I'm just kidding. Here we go. Oh, my God. Whoa! Hello there. Oh. Huh. Well, that's interesting. I was not expecting the maps to look like this for some reason. I've seen maps here and there. So I know the lines across the screen, not they're not on this one, but lines across the screens, if you have them, that means it's an ocean. So this is all land right here, and that's like a, a river system. And that dot... How am I supposed to know which direction to go, though? That's the scare. Am I just supposed to adventure forever until the dot starts getting a little bit bigger? That means I'm getting closer. Oh, that's some scary stuff. 
Oh, but we have one. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's go get the Ocean Explorer map, too. This dude probably loves me right about now. Here you go, buddy. Oh, no, that's gonna be like all my emeralds. Oh, well, it's worth it. Ocean Explorer map. Oh, boy. Oh, wow. Oh, and that's like in the complete opposite direction. My little dot's on the bottom right this time. <laughs> yeah, so we're gonna have to do like com two completely different like explorations for this. Man, that's, oh boy. How am I gonna do this? I guess, oh boy, oh boy. I can't stop looking at these. Guys, you have no idea how long I've waited for these. Ever since the 1.11 update for PC Minecraft, I've always wanted to get my hands on one because as you know, I'm an adventure slime. That's my favorite thing to do in Minecraft is an adventure. And when I heard about this Explorer update, man, oh man, I was jumping out of my seat. But as you know, there's lots of other things in this update. We're going to kind of explore them in this episode. Uh, I do want to head out for our adventure here pretty soon. Um, but I want to go ahead and mess with some stuff. You know what I mean? Mess with stuff? Do I have any wool? Yeah, you know what I mean. Uh, wait. Dies? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm doing? Hope you do. Uh, I need some of that, some of that. Give me some of that, and then do some of this, and some of that. One, two, three. <laughs> My favorite color bed. I've always wanted to do this. Huh. Oh, huh. Oh, I'm hurrying. I'm hurrying. There we go. And this is going to be light blue. Oh, that's awesome. Wait. So I want to go down here real quick. So those beds that I've already had, I wonder if they are already, like, red. You know what I mean? Uh, let me go down here. I've never broken that bed up here. This bed has broken on its own a lot of times because if you put signs on it. Oh, no, it's actually red. Okay. <gasps> now we got a blue bed. Oh, yeah, red bed. Oh, yeah, and we got to sleep in our, red, our blue bed. <laughs> More like a sky blue. That's like my favorite color is like a sky blue color. Um, awesome. And, oh, what the? Disappeared there. <laughs> we have concrete blocks. Guys, there's so much in this update. Oh, uh, let's go make some. So I have loads of gravel and actually have a lot of sand from the wither fight. Now, if I'm not mistaken, isn't it just like like some weird pattern kind of like TNT? Oh boy. First try right here. I guarantee it. First try. I got it right here. Uh-huh. Oh no. God dang. No, nah, I know what I did wrong. Let's go down here. Ow! Let's go down here real quick. Oh my gosh, I have not checked this in forever. Did it reach the second light? Oh it did! It finally reached the second light. Oh, oh my god, god, this is why I don't have many automatic farms, because this is just OP. I used to like it where I had a little bit of cactus here and there, but oh my gosh, this is OP. Okay, just take a stack out. Yeah, you have to have a dye color in the center of it, so you know what color we're making? We're making green. Okay, let's see if I get it right this time. Sand goes in corners, just like voila, and then gravel in these sections. So I was kind of right, but I forgot about the dye part. <gasps> Oh, my lord. Oh, yeah, look. Oh, <laughs> I don't know if I like that or not. If you have stuff in your crafting or whatever, and then you exit out, it used to plop down on the floor. Now it doesn't. That's pretty cool. Huh. Oh, it's just like colored sand. Oh, my gosh. Let's go dip it in some water. <laughs> um, will this water work? Probably, but I want to go do it in my river real quick. I want to see how much different it is from actual... Here, let's go. Oh, that looks really similar. Oh my. To my actual clay color. Where's my clay at? Wow, that's like almost... Oh no, there's like a slider shade. It's like... Yeah, that's pretty cool though. We're definitely going to use these for builds in the future. Look guys, I have two hands. <laughs> I finally learned how to use my left hand. What do you know about that? Oh yeah, I didn't forget either. I kind of wish they would have went ahead and added uh, just maybe where you can stick a torch in that hand or your food. That would have helped a lot. <gasps> oh my gosh. I am excited. I was sticking this in there forever wondering why it wasn't working. I forgot you actually have to use... Oh, it's called green terracotta now. Oh. I like stained clay better. <laughs> oh my gosh, I forgot. Oh, these things look so wonky. Well, I changed textures when I placed it. That was strange. Did you see that? That was weird. Oh, man. These things are so hard to work with. Like, I've spent so much time in creative on uh, PC messing with these, and they're really hard to work with, but I will find something to use with them in the future. Oh, my God. There's so many features in this update. <laughs> Guys, I can't believe this is Pocket Edition. There's, like, so much just going on here. <laughs> 
And hopefully we'll start getting some more villagers soon as well because there's Frostwalker and Mending now, which is super exciting. I can't wait to test out those new enchants. Now I'm now I'm wondering. Uh, oh, yeah, I got to try this. Oh, I got to try this. I'm excited now. You guys know how much armor we have, right? Yeah, you know what I'm thinking. Maybe you don't. Maybe you do. Maybe you don't. <laughs> I wonder how much you get out of a single one or something like that. You know what I mean? Can you stack them? No. What are we going to get? Oh, just one. Okay. Same as the others, I'm guessing. Just one. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, we have so much gold armor that it doesn't matter. I'm definitely going to do this with a lot of it so we can get some just golden apple or just gold going in general. Um, so yeah. So I actually decided this episode, I don't know if I'm going to actually head out this episode. I want to mess around with this new update there's llamas guys llamas <laughs> and i think i have a spawning area back there for them um so i might go i might want to go give that a try time to sleep in my oh yeah by the way they like sunsets look a lot better okay so normally when the sunset's behind that hill right now normally if you look in that direction you can see the orange sky but now you can look all around and it's an orange everywhere which is kind of cool but it's not that realistic when you think about it because orange is only near the sun I don't know. <laughs> it looks better, though. Definitely does. All right. What was I going to do? Oh, yeah. Sleep in my bed for the first time. My blue bed. Yee. All right. It's a couple of hours later now. I've been kind of just trading. Look, 45 emeralds. <laughs> and I've been learning about the update. I've been trying to like study some stuff and do all kinds of stuff because we are not ready to go on the adventure yet. I've got lots of learning to do about the maps and whatnot. But um, in the meantime, while I was trading, I managed to get another cartographer by breeding all of my <laughs> guys. We have so many villagers now. <laughs> it's unreal. But it took forever to get them. Um, let's, uh, I need paper. Okay, I got compasses. Because I want to trade with them. I'm testing to see if they give you different maps. Um, so we're going to go try that out real quick. And then after that, I want to go see if we can get some llamas. <laughs> Man, we're going to have to get a newer sugarcane farm soon. Uh, <laughs> like, it's barely growing for some reason. It's just because I'm not near it. I, you'd think I would be near it because I've been over there the whole time. But it's just not growing as fast. By the way, as well, I forgot these guys got an update for this update. <laughs> uh, well, as you know, they were all white before. That was a bug. But now they are colored again, and they are more vibrant, just like the PC got in their color update. Um, oh, yeah. By the way, I've been working on something in here for the past hour. Oh, not hour. <laughs> I just did this within the hour. Um, it looks weird. I know. But this is going to be the adventure room. I've been wanting to do this. Um, it's on our project wall, actually. Um, the adventure room is going to have big map walls, and I mean absolutely big, um, of each direction we go in. So the adventure we go off in, I'm going to try to record which way we go, and then when we get back, we can put it up on here. So it's going to be really cool, and then we can put up our ocean monument and woodland explorer map thingy-majiggers in here. <laughs> thingy majigger Maps. All right, now time to bust a myth that's for me, because I don't know if it works like this. I just got a new cartographer. I want to go see if I can trade with him. I think I got all the stuff. I got paper. I got compasses. And then I'll have to do a trade to buy a map, probably. I want to see if he'll give me a newer one. Oh, boy. This is... Oh, gosh. <laughs> I'm kind of excited. Or I'm going to be mad if he gives me the same one. <laughs> oh, calm down, guys. Is that him? No. He's in here somewhere. Where are you? Are you... That's him. No. Um, oh, gosh. They're all cuddling in the corner over here. Nope. No. Where is he? You. No. It's you. Yes, cartographer. He only has 25. That's awesome. All right. I'm excited. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and unlock all these trades real quick and then until we get to the Woodland Mansion one. Oh my god, I want to punch that villager in the face. <laughs> They're so annoying up there. This guy is giving me so much trouble. I traded so much stuff. I've already traded a map, too. I'm gonna have to do it again. Gosh, is he just not unlocking me anymore? I'm gonna be so mad. Come on, dude. Give me the maps. Look, he just won't unlock them. Is he bugged? I've been trading so much stuff with this guy. Like, an unbelievable amount. He just will not unlock any more maps. Is that how... Oh, no! Oh, yes. Oh! Okay, here we go. 22 emeralds. We got it right here. 
Is it a new map? Oh boy. All that work. <laughs> all that to work for nothing. I lost so many emeralds right there. It's all right. We have a backup map now. <laughs> oh, man. Even though I think you can duplicate these maps. You cannot. I've already tried. You cannot expand them, which I was, like, trying to figure out. But I've been trying. I've been studying these maps. I have been hard at work. Um, let me go get. Oh, okay. Let me just go over. Wait. No, I don't think these have compasses on them. Let me go in my house real quick and get a map. Well, we can just run over there together. Um, because at this point, when you first get the map, you don't really know which direction to go. You have to get a basic understanding, of course, where, which way is northwest, south, or east. And, of course, I mean, that's pretty easy to tell, I guess you can say, because north is mainly always like this. Okay, so as you can see, looking this way, I am looking down right now on the map. So that means, if you look at this map, I'm up in the top right and I was looking down, so that means this... Or let me get this map back out. <laughs> if I look... Oh, wait, I'm looking that way now. If I look that way, it is down in that... Wait, oh gosh, hang on a minute. <laughs> I'm getting confused. Wow, I'm glad I looked at that. For the longest time, I thought it was that way. Oh, I was thinking of my map being flipped around the other way. Okay, so <laughs> as you can see now, I'm looking this way on my map straight that direction and that means the woodland mansion is way out that way yeah that's how that works yeah well basically it's that way and that means as well if you didn't know our ocean map is is it still up here i think it is <laughs> that means it's in the opposite direction is my little marker on there no i have to grab it okay uh, yeah it's at the bottom right so that means this one is way out to that way huh so this is interesting. <laughs> um, so we are not going to go this episode because this is a big, big adventure. But I'm glad I now understand where I need to go. But um, one thing I want to do now, though, is get a llama. Okay, so we have some extreme hills out that way. I believe they are extreme hills behind the factory. Um, by the way, I'm not going to let things go unnoticed on here. If you saw my tweet earlier, I said something like, My game crashed and my mule despawned. Yes. Eeyore despawned and the, how it happened I was going out to the extreme hills because I was going to start looking for llamas on my way out there My game just crashed like Sometimes my computer does that for some reason it just crashes after restart it and when I got back on of course Eeyore was not under me that same old bug the way Admiral died or despawned way back then on the on old old adventure i was riding him my game crashed i joined back and he was gone same thing happened to eeyore and of course i'm not going to give eeyore a grave for that i it's a bug so i went and bred uh spud here with my fast horse and we got another eeyore so <laughs> yeah i'm not going to use a grave for despawning only when things die because despawning is just annoying from glitches all right maybe i should sleep first <laughs> Okay, there's a cow, there's a pig, not what I came here for. <laughs> yeah, so I believe these are extreme hills over here. They are, they, they are hills. Uh, they're not too extreme though. <laughs> um, there's a chicken. I'm liking the look of this, not really. Okay, so, I, this is so weird. I can't remember if I planted all these or not. I might have, I might have went on like a huge spruce planting spree because this looks kind of unnatural, doesn't it? I might have, oh, sheep, <laughs> I might have done this, to be honest, it kind of looks like it, I don't know, um, all right, yeah, okay, we definitely got some extreme hills over here, so I'm gonna go kind of snoop around a bit, and see if we can find one, okay, another, oh, there's one, oh my gosh, I was just gonna say, there's another sheep, <gasps> oh, our first llama, <laughs> he looks yellowish, oh my gosh, bud, behold your eyes, Look, it's a new creature. What do you think? He's like, dude, I don't really care. <laughs> oh my god, hey buddy. Look at his long neck. Oh my gosh, it's a llama. I have never actually seen a llama with my own eyes. I might have in another world, but I've never actually tamed one. And Do you tame him by just riding him? Oh, I'm riding a llama. <laughs> oh, he already loves me. Oh, it's love at first sight. Oh yes, I'm taking him home. This is, oh, we're going to name him Bart. No, not Bart. <laughs> we'll think of a name. How about... Ed. Yep. His name's Ed. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Come on, Ed. 
I'll meet you. Uh, I'll show you around, Spud. He's friendly. Um, just don't spit on him. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we have a llama in our homestead. <laughs> Buster, look what I found. It's a weird creature with a big neck. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. Um, oh, we're going to get you pimped out, buddy. Spud, you can go there. Uh, where are you going, sir? You just got here. Uh, you can go right over. Oh my god. We have so many animals, it is unreal. Is he chained up there? Awesome. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Alright, so, um, llamas are cool. I like them, but they're so useless. They should have made them more useful. At least ride them. Or add camels instead of them, but then that would kind of defeat the purposes of mules, donkeys, and horses. I know, there's always one thing that has to be better than the other, but one thing that lacks something than the other. You know what I mean? And one thing that llamas, they don't really help, like, they lack stuff, but they don't really improve stuff than other things. You know what I mean? Um, where do I have carpets? Wool. Uh, I kind of want a blue. I forgot how it works. Uh, so we need... Somebody, somebody. Oh, oh yeah. I want to try some of this. Um, how do you do it again? <laughs> oh, okay. I think it's just like normal carpet across the top, and you make carpet by, I think, two, like this. Oh yeah. <laughs> See, I know my stuff. And then we need a. Uh, oh, do I have no wood? I'm running out of wood, guys. This isn't good. And I know how to rhyme. <laughs> no. Oh, I'm literally using three different wood to make a chest. That's how poor... Oh, I don't need three different. All right, there we go. Okay. Get this out. Oh, and before we go on our trip, I'm going to have to go get some more wood because I used all of my whole stack of birch wood for all them item frames you saw in the new adventure room down there. Yikes. <laughs> so I'm going to have to do a big bone meal spree on some trees. Hey, why didn't I go down that? Ed! Ed, Ed, Ned! <laughs> I used to watch that all the time. Voila! Oh, no. Um. Oh, there it is. Oh, that's so cool. Whoa. Whoa, I didn't know it does that much. That is awesome, man. And then the chests. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yeah, they only hold six. Man, that makes them really unuseful then. I mean, the only purpose for them is the caravan thing. Like, if you're pulling one with a rope, all the others follow this one. But you know how much stuff falls off ropes, and it's just annoying. You turn around, they're all way back behind you. It's just like, ah. These things just seem like a hassle, to be honest with you. But they're cool. They are cool. We have a fr Oh, we need to name them. Ed. <laughs> you think it would, could be spelled different than that? Just Ed. <laughs> Is there a different... Maybe two Ds? Ed. No, I like... I like it simple. Just Ed. <laughs> yeah. All right. Ed. Here you go. Welcome to the family. Oh, yeah. He's going to be here forever with us. Now we just need polar bear guys we don't have any polar bears but then again the closest winter biome is thousands and i mean absolutely thousands of blocks away so our luck with getting one of them is probably 0.01 percent you know oh man we probably won't get any polar bears all right guys all i got to do now is prepare for the big adventure this is going to be one of the toughest adventures we'll ever face on here um mainly because most of the time, they spawn like 10,000 blocks away. Even more than that or less than that, give or take. Who knows? Um, so, yeah, it is off in that direction. Here is home, as you can see. And we have a village over here. Now, as you can see, there's a little gray line below my white dot up there. I'm going to run all the way to the village and see if just my white dot happens to move a tiny bit. Just a tiny bit in any direction or whatever. Just to see if how far it actually is because if i travel it's pretty oh god i hate rain <laughs> um it's my village is pretty far over here oh whoa it just got bigger whoa 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 <gasps> wow guys is it that close what the heck no way look at the Oh my gosh, guys, how close is it? This is pretty amazing. I'm still going to go out to the village and see if it moves any. Oh my. <laughs> All right, I'm approaching the village. You guys have seen this quite a lot um, in the past. Didn't move a tiny bit. <laughs> oh god, that is worrying. Um, oh, my villagers still here? Got oh, they are. Oh wow. I doubt there's any cartographers, obviously. 
Um, hi there, farmer. Ooh, I can come here and get some emeralds. Ooh, who are you? Ha! Ah, librarian. Oh, I traded with him. Fortune through two. Oh, I didn't get his next trade. Hi there. This rain is so obnoxious. Hang on a minute. All right, that should have made it a little bit lighter. All right, so, <laughs> um, let's see here. Yeah, it didn't move a tiny bit. I'm still going to walk a little in this direction. Hey, they made a bridge for me. <laughs> um, and just see. I'm not going to obviously go on the adventure. Uh, I'm just going to go a little bit further just to see if it slightly nudges at all. And then we'll head back and probably in the episode. Oh, wow, I just now realized that. Hey, whoa, a portal. Wow, I, I remember this portal, actually. I just now realized I didn't do a comment question of the day last episode, so I'm going to have to do two this episode. My bad. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be one crazy adventure. Um, yeah. <laughs> it's going to be so long. It didn't even nudge a tiny bit. I'm still by that portal. I didn't go too far, but I'm not going to go any further than I have because I just don't want to go too far right now. I wonder what's over. Oh, is that a... Looks like a plains biome over there. Interesting terrain over here. It's been a while since I've explored around here. I've never actually explored on Windows 10 yet on this world, so this is going to be kind of fun, to be honest, <laughs> because I remember how much of a hassle it used to be using touch controls. What if, like, the Wooden Mansion was just sitting right there? <laughs> I was thinking, when I saw that dot blow up like it did, I was thinking, like, what if it just plopped one right in my, uh, uh, what is it? Uh, my, oh my god, what is it called? The woodland, just my forest. <laughs> What if it popped one, like, right in there? Uh, that would have been amazing. Anyway, I'm going to head back home now. Time to do the comment question of the day. Okay, um, I'm mad. Signs are completely different now, and it's annoying. <laughs> As you can see, there's only three lines of text now. You can no longer have four lines. Like, what the heck? <laughs> why would you do that? You just made signs worse. I don't know why they did that. You can't write on the fourth line now. It's kind of silly. Um... At least I couldn't. I hit enter and it would never go down. And you can't even go back up. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. I don't know. I probably was, but oh well. The first comment comes from, oh gosh, Nicholas Ayala. They ask, favorite game besides Minecraft? I think I've answered this before. Um, I probably have because, oh, oh, favorite biome in Minecraft. Okay. I was just looking for it, my bad. <laughs> Favorite game in Minecraft. A lot of you probably know this. Um, the only reason I say this, or I picked that one, is because, I, if you guys didn't know, I'm actually a huge gamer outside of YouTube. Like, I love games. I love RPG games. I have an Xbox One. That's what I play mostly on. Um, I've been playing it, like, since 360 came out. It's like, I've, I've been, lo I love gaming, man. <laughs> Especially RPGs. And right now, like, my favorite game of all time, as most of you know, is The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. Um, it's an unbelievable game, and I've actually been getting back into it. And they're actually getting a Netflix series for it, and I'm just, like, so excited for it. Um, but yeah, other than that, I guess, like, Skyrim, maybe? And <laughs> other RPG games, Fallout 4? All those types of games are my favorite, because they, in a way, remind me of Minecraft. That's why I'm in love with Minecraft so much. Hey, Ed! Ed's down there. <laughs> because you can do what you want. I mean, I spawned in this world with nothing. And look what I created. Isn't that just amazing to think about? I mean, I did this. <laughs> Especially on a phone. <laughs> um, yeah, in The Witcher 3, I love that game so much. Obviously, there's no building in it. But it's just the backstory about it. And adventuring a world. And you're basically a bounty hunter in medieval times. It's so cool. Try it out. Try it out. It's awesome. <laughs> but thank you for your question. Next one comes from... Are you playing with a mouse? Ryan Davis asks that. <laughs> you, you have no idea how many times people have asked me that. It's like, oh, why do I hear clicking? Is he playing with a mouse? Yes, I am playing with a mouse. You hear that? That's a mouse. <laughs> um, I, it's because a lot of newcomers come, obviously, and I title my videos, Let's Play Minecraft PE. Um, I put a disclaimer in the description. Most people don't read descriptions, though. Saying that... Over time, I obviously switched over to Windows 10 because my I can no longer literally play Pocket Edition on my phone. It is so laggy. Like, it looks like this almost now. Like, like that's how laggy it is. It is awful. Like, I would have to get a new phone or a NVIDIA Shield tablet. And, um, yeah, I didn't want to change the name. Like, this is still Pocket Edition. Like, literally, it still is. It updates when Pocket Edition does. 
as everything Pocket Edition has. I mean, I built this world on Pocket Edition and it's able to transfer to this. It's just Pocket Edition with a keyboard and a mouse. So that's why I haven't changed my name or the title of these videos to Let's Play Minecraft Windows 10. I'm just going to keep it at PE because that's how it normally was. Isn't that right, Ed? <laughs> they look so fun. I kind of want to hit him just for him to spit at me. Ed, I'm sorry, but let me just smack you a little. <coughs> ah! <God. laughs> Ew, no, I'm sorry, Ed. All right, well, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, I'm I'm about ready to get out of this dang butter armor. That's <laughs> look at him. He's like, ah, like Jay. <laughs> yeah, I'm ready to get out of this butter armor. That is so adorable. And get on our diamond armor and go adventuring. We'll start that next episode to find the woodland mansion. See you guys there. Bye-bye.